Hello and welcome to Q30 News. I'm Michaela Pascal. Tonight we're following breaking news after receiving confirmation of a diphtheria breakout in Hamden, Connecticut. Kim has more on how Quinnipiac is preparing students and faculty. Thank you, Michaela. I'm Kim. Diphtheria sounds more like a spell from Harry Potter than a disease that has caused five deaths in the last five years. Although the numbers are small, the risk of catching the disease during an outbreak is high. Students are asked to report to the health center immediately if they have not received the vaccine. I asked some students what they knew about diphtheria and if they were vaccinated. Have you heard about the recent diphtheria outbreak at Quinnipiac? Um, what's diphtheria? Have you heard about the recent diphtheria outbreak at Quinnipiac? No, I don't even know what that is. Diphtheria is a respiratory illness that is caused by Cordybacterium diphtheria. It is characterized by a sore throat, severe cough, low fever, and the most prominent symptom is a white pseudomembrane that forms on the tonsils, pharynx, and soft palate. Diphtheria was once a popular infectious disease that caused the deaths of many, but has been nearly eradicated due to the creation of the diphtheria tetanus pertussis vaccine. This vaccine is 97% effective and is paramount in preventing another outbreak like this one. Have you received your diphtheria vaccination? Yeah, I get my vaccinations every time I'm supposed to, I guess. Have you been vaccinated for diphtheria? Probably. I get all my routine vaccinations, so I assume so. Have you been vaccinated against diphtheria? Um, no, I wasn't. My mom was afraid of the side effects. Do you have children? Are they vaccinated? I think they are not. Why aren't they vaccinated? They because I've heard that there are some serious side effects with the vaccine, and I didn't want to do that with my children. How did you contract the illness? Well, um, <coughs> a bunch of kids in my class were coughing pretty heavily the other day, so I think I got it from one of them. Were you vaccinated for diphtheria before you contracted the illness? No, my parents were <coughs> actually uh, afraid to get me vaccinated as a child. <coughs> Have you received treatment yet for diphtheria? Well, <coughs> as soon as I was diagnosed with diphtheria, I began receiving the antitoxin neurothromycin and I'm no longer contagious. My doctor told me that I'm lucky enough that I caught it early and I'm gonna make a full recovery. <coughs> The diphtheria vaccine has been a controversial topic for some time now. Some people are not getting their children vaccinated because they believe it will cause paralysis and seizures. The probability of this happening is extremely unlikely though. Well, one in ten can actually die from diphtheria. Uh, one in a million will have a serious side effect. So what we do is we really encourage people to get vaccinated. Protect yourselves and your children and get vaccinated by your doctor immediately to prevent contracting diphtheria.